Before the break, I asked the question on everyone's lips, what links Gemma Collins with O.J. Simpson? The answer is, they both struggle to find gloves that fit. Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> They've both lied in interviews. Ooh. Gemma, have you been telling fibs in interviews, my friend? Yeah, go on. <laughs> yeah, go on. It's, it's about the sex tapes. How do you know about this? Because it's on my card. <laughs> right, so basically, I said in an interview once, thinking it was funny, yeah, I've done a sex tape like Kim K. Didn't think no more of it. Oh. Ha, ha, laughed it off. Next thing, I'm now being interviewed by Piers Morgan on Life Stories. <laughs> so he sort of leads me in it, so he goes to me, you've done a sex tape, and he's I thought, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I just said, ha, ha, yeah. And now I'm in deep. So then he goes, what, what point does a reality star kind of draw their moral compass? You know, Ooh. would you sell the sex tape for money? So then I went, thinking it was all a joke. Well, yeah, I'd set up the call line so I'd make on the profits from the phoning. <laughs> Paper, you, you know, the business mind's going. And then he says, how does it feel? He looks over to my parents in the audience. Oh, no. And he goes, well, how does it feel for your mum and dad to hear this? Yeah. Anyway, I got myself in whole hot water. Then he goes to me, who was the sex tape with? I gave a name. <gasps> <laughs> Was it Nick Knowles? No, I'd like it to be with Nick Knowles. I fancy him. Oh. Oh, he's yeah. got something about him, old Nick. Well, he's got an extension, that's for sure. <laughs> Sorry, I've just gonged you for fancying Nick Knowles. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm never going to live it down, but there is no sex tape. It's one big god-awful lie. What I like is that you said you were in deep and no-one made a cheap gag, and that's a really classy show. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny, honey.